Poco X3 or the Poco X3 NFC Android version 14 Blaze version 3.8 Evo L here it's not Android 15 based yet I have already made Android 15 based for Poco F5 you can check out that video what all the changes we get but here it's a Android 14 based on 3.8 and 5th of September 2024 is the security by September 19 let's just build 4.1 4.3 4 and it has the kernel use if Linux status is enforcing here that's the interface again very similar to what we have seen in the previous version and these are the quick settings toggles i really like them arranged kind of android tall style and these are the extra options you get you also get dolby atmos pre-installed in this room and these quick settings toggles are very smooth and responsive guys and you also get advanced restart button in this particular room guys and this is typical home skin if a person hold here again you get widgets those are based on android 14 only and smoothness everywhere i have noticing the smoothness here and even wallpaper sound style again it remains very similar as you can see you get this more wallpapers and theme icons has been enabled and as you can see now theme icons has been enabled and camera application again you get Leica integrated here which is good thing in my opinion again in the video more you also get 4k 30 even in the ultra wide it's available if you want anything uh ultra kind of camera you can use g cam ports many videos are available in my channel check out those channels and again join the whatsapp group for this particular device guys and call recording here directly it's not enabled you need to use this basic call recording option enable from here and allow while using the app allow allow all the permissions again output directory you can select from here format also you can select from here once the call has been uh, dialed and make it recorded you can visually see in file manager that's cool thing and Dolby Atmos is again added a free thing here which is going to expense I mean oh, your audio experience will get richer here that's what I want to say again people waiting for results will go for that fast and again guys I want to confirm one more thing like if you search in the play store uh, the Android 2 it's not officially available as you can see it's not available not just that the CPU throttling test also it's not available as you can see this one something new has been uh, given here uh, it's taking some time here CPU throttling test yeah I have noticed this issue in the ROM guys whenever I search in the play store even uh, it takes some time as you can see this one is there but what are we see for example I want to show this because why I'm showing this I want to explain this you will get understand why i will not show those things for example cpu throttling test as you can see it's 11 july 2020 it's very old app you can't even just justify the uh, cpu throttling test using this old app many people will show you this app and show you the results that you want to believe it i am not going to show those kind of apps and all i will show you the genuine applications and genuine results and genuine thing whatever i will say that is going to make a huge difference 736 is single score and 187 is a multi-score and it was 14 and this is the basic integrity and status profile match getting pass and device is also certified here and this is the regarding sdr 10 support and level 1 certification again guys if i show like this oh it's hdr supported yeah but when you play the hdr video my own videos i have tested in the poco x3 playing them it will become white here that's what thing is practical thing is always important rather than just seeing the results here and this is the 11 1 certification again read read speed test and 240 mbps i have airtel fiber connection around 300 mbps and charging speeds are also good here i haven't faced any issues regarding that and i'm really liking this quick setting toggles if you are also liking give it a like to other channel again blazers you get plenty of customizations i already covered them in the previous video you can check out them and majority of the changes has been enabled again high fps in games for some reason i am not able to open the games let me show you that first if i can able to log in the game then i would be better to show you the game meanwhile you can go and subscribe to my channel also give it a like and check out the playlist of poco x or the poco x nfc you get plenty of videos available in my channel check them out again we'll see whether it gets uh, logged in or not yeah sign into google see please and graphic settings we have enabled that 60 but here it is showing yeah 90
that's good again in the lobby also you can enable them that's the graphic settings there's a new bgma 3.4 update and also this one the game has been updated and the rom with security latest security patch there is a lag once i encounter a number of players i mean enemies around me there is a lag but yeah it's still playable again you need to always remember that your smartphone chipset is snapdragon 732g that people always compare with high-end devices don't compare them again even if you have 90 or 240 fps that is not going to maintain the processor the brain of the uh, computer is cpu that is very important guys rather than any other things but reload yeah and there's a volume panel and this is the quick settings toggles how it looks like you guys can see smoother interface that i can assure you but gaming experience uh, it's again see if you compare with the similar uh, powered smartphone it's fine but if you compare with high-end smartphones even if you have very good rom it will not going to compare that you need to understand that that's the basic thing you all should always understand and your skills and internet connectivity all these factors makes very huge difference in terms of getting very good gaming experience where is the enemy yeah that's it i'll come back here we'll show you the fingerprint unlock also yeah before that i want to show this one systems into the gestures again yeah i swipe the screenshot navigation mode um, is it so delay yeah you won't get any increasing of just a bar and length anyhow and also show you the battery life have if it is recorded oh uh, it has not been recorded but i can say it's moderate to better i can say it's not bad though and the finger bent on top yeah why oh, it is delayed it's not so fast for some reason for first time but now it's getting fast and the face unlock again it's fast that's like taking some time but anyhow it's a very good rom guys you can use it as a daily drug for poco x3 or nfc and if you have any specifications comment down in the comment section i will definitely recommend this as to be used as a daily drug no eti about android 15 you can check out the android 15 video i already made for poco f5 again we'll meet you with another interesting video guys this is sampath signing off until that keeps smelling Baba for now.